guys, my name is Jack Subtigai and welcome to a game called The Long Dark. I've been meaning to play this game for a very long time. I did try it out when it first came out in early access quite a while ago, but there wasn't really a whole lot to it and it's been fleshed out a lot since. There's been a lot of updates to it. I don't know what's new in it since I tried it out, but some people have been suggesting it ever since it did come out and I really wanted to play it, but I didn't want to have too many survival games going on at once, so now I feel like it's a very good time to get into it. There is no story to the game yet. It's not available in alpha. This still is an early access game. So we're just going in and play the sandbox and I wanted to play this because it's like snowy foresty mountains and I really love that stuff. So what do we got? Uh, choose your experience. This is you wanted the long road to observe the quiet apocalypse chronicle for players who are most interested in pensive exploration Wildlife will not attack you. No! Players who are looking for reasonably challenge exploration. Yeah, we just go in middle of the road. We see what it's like. Ooh, coastal highway, pleasant valley, or mystery lake. I'm gonna go mystery lake because this background looks like the nicest. Um, and I'm just gonna be a dude. I'm gonna be Chuck Norris in this wilderness. I'm just gonna go off and punch alligators in the face. I don't think there's actually any alligators. A mysterious geomagnetic storm has brought your plane crashing down in the northern Canadian wilderness. How long can you survive? We'll see. We'll see if it's a long dark or a short bright. <laughs> On a long enough timeline, the survival rate for everyone drops to zero. Chuck Palanwick. I don't know how to pronounce that. Ah, oh, yes. This is what I want. Oh god, I thought there was like wolves over there. I like this. this I'm turning up my volume. Because I want to hear like the the wind in the background. This is exactly my kind of my kind of game. My aesthetic. Oh, it's very nice. It's very pretty. That's one of the reasons I really wanted to play it was just for the exploration stuff. Okay, so I don't really know what I'm doing. I, well, I guess survive, but I don't know. I think it's just wildlife that attacks you like wolves. Maybe some badgers. I don't know if I can get the rabbit. Come here, rabbit. Come here, rabbit. No, he's getting away from me. I need to go find a weapon, like an axe or something. Oh, there's deers! Hello, deer! You want to be my friend? It's very hard to see anything. Deadfall area. That sounds like a very good, nice place to be, doesn't it? So, I, and I like these games as well because they're cozier. They're, there's more of an internet, intimate internet. There's more of an intimate thing between me and you guys as well whenever I play these games. You just sit down, relax, explore for a while and see what's going on. And I can break away from the game. It's not all just funny moments kind of stuff. Unless something's going to come out and bite me in the ass. <laughs> but I really like the snow effect. It actually looks like snowflakes. Because every every other game seems to have like snowballs that come down. But this is really nice. Equipment. Do I have all this stuff? Good God. I have a lot of shit. First aid. That's a sexy body. I have no afflictions. Start a fire. Insufficient materials to start a fire, need fuel. Okay. Bedroll. No, 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 no. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. No, back. Back away, not today. Um, log. Discover deadfall area. I've had an exciting morning. <laughs> I need to go find stuff. I need to go find shelter. Oh, it's a train track. Why? Do you lead to anything? Tunnel collapse. Okay, I found a new thing. Do I have a map? No. Great. Unless I do, and I just don't know the button for it. Oh, metal container. What's in it? Searching. Searching. Empty. Great. First aid kit. A candy bar. I'm gonna take that shit. A typical a sewing kit. A sewing kit required for craft and repair. Ooh. And nothing else. Okay. I found some things. I'm making progress. What is cedar firewood? I'm gonna take you. I'm gonna build a badass fire. Oh, I leave footprints as well. Good. God, this is a harsh, wintry landscape. The winds have kicked up. Help! Mayday! Maybe we should head towards the peak. Summit peak. I have no idea where I'm going. There's another summit over there. Fuck. Hopefully nothing attacks me, because I have nothing to defend myself with yet. I don't think I can, like, chop down trees or anything. Unless I build an axe. I don't, I, like, I don't know the mechanics of the game. I don't know if you actually can get an axe and chop down trees or anything like that. I do need to find shelter though. Ooh, ooh, Canadian fire cabin. Freezing, condition 100%. Okay, Canada, yeah. Canada sucks. It's full of very snow and cold. <laughs> I don't like Canada already. <laughs> Never been there, but all the games I've been in, it's very cold. Camp office. There must be somebody in here if it's an office. Hello? It's all blue in here. 
Okay, is there like a stove or something? Stove! Pot belly stove. Yes. Can we put in cedar firewood? Yes. Put it put it in. How do how do I put it in? I don't know how I do anything. Oh, accelerant. None. Oh wait, it's optional, so maybe I can just start a fire? Yeah! Starting fire! Jeez, it takes forever to start a fire. Can I melt away the cold, frosty outside of this place? And will it turn red? That'd be cool! If it, like, turned from blue to red. Good God, it's taking me forever to start this fire. So how are you guys doing? You guys haven't been trapped in the cold? I hate the cold. I like- I like looking at it, I like- I know I complain about rain a lot in games. But I actually like when it rains outside. I like all types of weather. I like when it rains outside because it's very cozy inside then. When you hear the pitter patter of rain outside. And I like snow. I really like to be out in it and I like to look at it but not for too long. Because the fucking heat or the cold gets to me and I hate it. it uh, I get really really like painful when it's cold. Because I have terrible circulation in my fingers and my feet. So it gets very painful after a while. I like this. This is really nice to look at. Oh, so cozy. Okay, can I see what my condition is? No afflictions. Status, 97%. Great! Ooh! Cold. My cold is going down. Nice. Okay, let's search around. What do we got? We got a workbench. I can make... what? Old man's beard wound dressing. Okay. Torch. <gasps> I need kerosene and reclaimed wood. Fuck, I used wood. A snare. A hook. A line, a fishing tackle. I can make a load of shit! Ooh, I found some gloves! Nice! And I found lots of granola bars. They're gonna keep me nice and healthy. I love granola, man. It tastes delicious. And it's good for you. Bandage? Yes. I'm so glad I found this place! Canada, you rock! <laughs> um, actually, no, Canada, you snow. <laughs> Canada, snow, good. Requires hatchet to break down. I just wanted to sit in it, man! Up we go. Are you a corpse? Jeez, candy bar! Beef jerky! Sorry about your death! <laughs> right, let's let's search around. There must be more shit in this place. Come on! Come on, porno mags! There's a wood stove upstairs as well. I have another bedroll. I have a cupboard and a book. Dude, this is complex! I can break down the chair. But it, it requires 250 calories, and I have 1582, but I get three reclaimed wood out of it. What about the table? Needs require- it requires a hatchet to break down. Ooh, you guys break down into wood as- okay, I'll break down these guys. Breaking down, about two hours of daylight left. There's a lot to this game, I did not know that. Painkillers! Nice. Can I- can I rest? Hours to rest. Fucking hell, current calories 1433 and they're going down fast. Animated calories burned 75. This is like maths! I don't like this! It's morning. Um, I'm dehydrated, so I need to start like doing shit. I need to start drinking and- uh, what are you? Antibiotics. No. Tongue Can I- Tongue feels like sandpaper. Your tongue feels like sandpaper. Great! I'm gonna eat you. I'm gonna get all back my calories. Yes! I need- I need a good bit of calories. I'm just gonna eat two of them. And then we'll be fine. I do need to find some fluids though. <gasps> I do have fluids! Nice! Derailment. Can I get into any of these? I have a feeling they might have some nice supplies in them. Supplies, motherfucker. Can I not- can I not get in? No. God damn it, come on! There's a door right there! Oh, I'm shielded from the wind right now. That's what the icon in the bottom means. That's pretty cool! Okay, good to know. So I can actually shield myself and that's probably a good place to start fires then. Whenever I'm lying down. Start a fire, put down my bedroll, go to sleep, nice as rice. Is this all wood on the ground that I can be picking up? That I'm not picking up? Yep. Break down? Ugh, okay. I'll make some sticks. It was a stick already! Take. Take. Okay, I got two sticks. Fantastic. What did they do for me? Can I craft on the go? Oh, there's just natural sticks laying down, not branches. This could be good. This could be good. Sticks are good. I can make a fire with them. Okay, my guy is freezing, so I'm- Can I start a fire? There we go. Yeah, start fire. Good, good! It takes forever to start fires in this game! The fire has started! Why is it taking all of this time up here? Come on! Heat yourself! Oh yeah! 
Oh, it's gonna be nice. Oh, toasty, warm, and nice. Fluffy, fluffy, nice, nice. It does actually make me feel all nice and cozy, just looking at the fire there on the ground. Oh, yeah. I, I started the fire in here because we're shielded from the wind in here. That's a nice fucking roaring fire. Yes. Fire starting skill increased to 52. What was it at? <laughs> Okay, is my- yes. My thirst is going up, but my cold is going down. My hunger's going up, my fatigue is going up. Ugh. Should I eat something else? Or should I ration it out? No, I'll ration it out. So I don't know how long I'll be, I'll be out here in the cold. I'm not- I'm probably not going back to that other place either. Because it's going to take me too, too much time and too many calories to get back to it. So I, I just relax here. Ten minutes remaining. Nine minutes remaining. How fast did these go down? They're not real minutes, are they? I doubt that they're real minutes. Eight minutes remaining. They're not real minutes. That's why my other fire went out so fast. Melt snow. Ooh. Melting snow. About 12 hours of daylight left. Okay. Unsafe water added to inventory. Ooh. This is interesting. Where's my unsafe water? Ugh. Drink? May make you ill. Yeah, but I'm thirsty! Drink it. Fuck it. YOLO! Hopefully I can get something else. I just need weapons. I, I need stuff to be able to get resources. That's my problem right now. I've had very temporary resources and those have run out by now. Ooh, that looks like a big place! Yes! And you following the train track would lead me to salvation. Salvation ho! Train bridge! Thank you. I did not know what this was until you said it. Could I melt the snow in the lake? And boil that? And get rid of all the germy germs? I wanna, I wanna go in here. Is that a dam? A dam! Dam! Ooh, a great! Great! <laughs> Futurama joke. One of the best jokes in the entire series. <laughs> okay, let's go in here and see what's in it. Hopefully, nice things. Hopefully dead bodies full of Carter Hydro Dam. It's good to know. Are you dead, buddy? Ravaged deer carcass. Ooh! Yes, take everything. I, d I don't care if I can actually... 783. Carcass more than 50% frozen, cannot use bare hands. So I need like a knife? Fuck! What's inside? Okay, it's very fucking dark. Hello? Great. Great. <laughs> okay, go through the door. Man, it's dark in here. I can't see anything. My guy is almost dead. I had to turn off all of my recording lights to just search this area. I have no idea where I was going or anything like that. I was still freezing indoors. I can't light a campfire indoors. So it's back out into the harsh fucking landscape we go where my guy is almost certainly gonna die. Like, oh God, oh God, oh God. Am I breaking legs or something? Can I start a fire down here or under the bridge? Something actually here seems like a much better area to do it. Um, start fire. Here we go. Um, yeah, chance of success, ninety-two percent. Hundred percent chance of success. Doesn't make it last longer. Okay, we're just gonna start a fire. Good lord! I need to like get stuff that I can cook. I need to be able to get meat or whatever. I'm bad at this game. It's very very harsh. I mean, of course it would be. You're out in the snow. The, uh, like this type of scenario in real life, you would die very, very fast if you had no supplies. Um, but Jesus Christ, I couldn't see anything in that other place and there was nothing of value in there either. You faded into the long dark. Because I tried to sleep. You survived for 21 hours. I didn't even survive a day. This is harsh as fuck. I want to go again. Should we go a Pleasant Valley or... Coastal highway, maybe. You found your way to the coastal highway, which winds its way around a weathered, battered coastline with small clusters of habitation to be found along the way. Sounds like a good place. We play as a girl this time. Yay! Okay, we'll try and survive a bit longer this time. Now that I kind of know the mechanics, not really, but good lord, this game is harsh as all hell. It's fun though. He knelt among the shadows and felt his isolation bitterly. There were savages, it was true, but they were human. William Golding, Lord of the Flies. Great. Oh, this does not look promising. There's a little hut down there already. And there's a house up there. I like this one. Yes, more of this. I'm not going to fall through the ice, am I? Don't fall through the ice. I need you to survive. Are you even a thing? That I can enter? You're very tiny. Okay, 
Go inside. Ooh! Ice fishing hole! 100% frozen. Great. Cardboard matches. Got him. Cloth. Got him. Potbelly stove. I don't need you yet. I have a fishing hook already. This is already 100% better. Okay, there's nothing in these. New sprint. Nice. Cool! Okay. So, there's no workbench in here though. <gasps> Pinnacle peaches! I think I can use this. Oh, I bet you can. Okay, moving on. We're gonna head up to the other place as well. I don't know if sprinting brings down your calories more. There's another little hut over there. There's a tiny other hut over there. And these all likely have fishing holes in them, because that's what they are. Okay! Nice! Canada, you rock! I mean... Be cool if I was in California, or Florida, or somewhere like that. Uh, there'd be lots of sunshine around either. But I mean, for what I have, it's pretty good. <laughs> oh, there's little huts everywhere around that lake. I assume this is a region where the lake is constantly frozen. And it never actually, like, thaws out. Because those little huts would sink. There's a nice little cabin here, though. Misanthropes Homestead. I'm just going to set up house here and never leave. This is where I'm going to live for the rest of my life. Which is probably very short. <laughs> I got dog food. Can of wet dog food. Smells bad, but eating it is better than starving. Probably. I don't know about that. I always wonder as well, if I was in those situations, would I actually eat, like, oh, terrible things just to survive? I mean, I probably would. But it's like, do you eat it and possibly get sick and waste more calories? I can break down curtains. Really? <laughs> okay, keep searching. There must be good shit in here. Summit soda. Yes, that'll do nicely. This game is so fucking dark. Must be something in the fridge. Come on, nothing in the fridge. A rainbow trout. Nice. I'm gonna build a fire and cook that some bitch. But yeah, the game is so dark and there's no like gamma options to turn it up either. So I'm sorry if it's really hard to see shit. I'm right there with you. Like my computer monitor is at max brightness as well, and I still can't see shit. Be nice if I had a torch. Insulated boots. I got a fleece sweater as well. I heard a creak downstairs. Is that a monster? Don't be a monster. Come on, there's another drawer. Did I check all the drawers? Okay, fine. Um, okay, let's see what these things were. I think one of them was worse. Um, flea sweater, eighty-eight percent. That's so much better. Nice! Okay, and the other thing was worse than the insulated boots. No, they weren't. They were 38%. Shred, call me a Canadian already. Um, I can take water out of the toilet. I'm gonna take all the water out of the toilet. When in doubt, toilet it out. Added, that's potable water as well, really. I can actually drink that straight from the toilet. I mean, I guess it would be super fucking cold and I doubt anything will probably live in it. Is that it? There's benches and everything. I can destroy all of this shit if I had a hatchet. And I don't know how to make a hatchet, and I think I might have to leave. God, fuck. There's no, like, workbenches in any of these areas. There's, like, a fence over there and a house. There's another house over there, and there's more fences over there. There's houses everywhere in this one. I like this! Why didn't I play this map first? You fucking gas out here! When can I actually, like, start up a fire? Make it, like, a business out here. So, I, I don't want to search the oven, I want to use the oven! Oh, could end up being useful. Cooked rabbit! Can opener? This is the best! I'm gonna start a fire. Well, maybe. I have lots of fatigue. Let's fight for three hours. Okay, I'm eating nuts, by the way. <laughs> the game is making me hungry by, like, finding all the food. Ooh, boots! Insulated boots. Are, are you good? Let's see. 24, 38, 87! DUDE! I'm doing so well! Um, it was the same when I, when I read the book. Have you ever read the book The Road? Some of you have probably seen the movie of The Road. Viggo Mortensen is in it. Aragorn. But I remember reading the book of The Road and it was one of the few books I've actually ever read. And when they like found cotton socks. When they found a place with like food in it, like a food shelter. I was like, oh, because it's a, it's, a, it's a movie all about, or a book all about surviving in like an apocalypse kind of scenario. And whenever they found food or water or anything like that, they really made you feel like, oh, they, like, they hit the jackpot and they made you feel like so satiated for them. It's like, I want to find like that much food and care about it that much. Why is there a flare in the sink? 
And it, it almost makes you feel hungry listening to that kind of stuff. Okay, it said that there was two hours of light remaining, or daylight remaining, so I'm gonna sleep for like, what, eight hours? I don't know, the clock in this game, so it's gonna save anyway. Less than one hour of darkness left, eight hours of darkness left. So, I'm gonna save, uh, my guy is really, or my girl, even, she's really, really well, like, her condition is really good, except her thirst right now. Drink up, lady. You'll be fine. Don't even worry about it. Good God, they get thirsty fast. Are you good now? Yes, everything's good. So everything is saved. I can't see shit because it's night time. Apparently, this game is impossible to see. So we're gonna sleep more. I forgot how many hours of darkness it said was left. There's question mark hours of darkness left. That's very helpful. Am I am I resting? Are we waking up now? Is it daytime? Is it morning? I don't fucking know. Anyway, I'm gonna leave this episode here. It, let me know what you guys think of this game. I think it's really, really cool. I think there's a lot of potential to it. I don't know, like, once I start crafting proper materials, I get an axe or, I don't know if there's guns or anything in it. That'd be kind of cool. I, I'm looking forward to seeing what the enemies are like. If I can find wolves and kill them and like start harvesting more stuff instead of just going around exploring, finding stuff. So I'm looking forward to seeing what else the game has. Let me know what you guys think of it. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, punch that like button in the face like a boss and hi you guys all around. Whoosh, whoosh. But thank you guys and I will see all you dudes. Come here, bitch. Oh, that's right. Oh, once I get one stab, I get all the stabs. I'm just gonna keep stabbing until you're dead. Come here, come back. Face me while I kill you. He's dead. He's, that was fun. I hear another one. That game made me really damn hungry. All this granola bars, pork and beans, water and everything. I'm gonna go eat.